For years, fans of R&B singer Ashanti have been wondering, where is her son? The star has famously kept her young son out of the spotlight, never publicly revealing his name or showing his face. But now, in a tell-all interview, Ashanti is finally opening up about the intensely personal reasons behind her decision to shield her child from the public eye. Ashanti burst onto the music scene in the early 2000s with a string of hit songs like Foolish, Happy and Rock With You, Our Baby. With her sultry voice and girl-next-door charm, she quickly became one of the biggest R&B stars of the decade. Ashanti's debut album sold over 3 million copies and earned her multiple Grammy nominations. But behind the scenes, Ashanti's personal life was going through major changes. In 2003, she began dating hip-hop mogul Nelly. The two high-profile artists dated on and off for nearly a decade before calling it quits in 2012. Then, in 2013, Ashanti revealed she was pregnant, though she refused to disclose the identity of the father. She gave birth to a baby boy that same year but has steadfastly refused to share any details about her son with the public. No photos, no name, no information about his father. Ashanti has been incredibly protective of her child's privacy since the day he was born now. Ten years later, Ashanti is finally opening up about her decision to keep her son out of the spotlight. In a candid new interview, the singer explained that her traumatic past experiences played a major role. When I found out I was pregnant, I was overjoyed but also terrified, Ashanti says. I had seen firsthand how cruel and invasive the media and public can be, especially towards celebrity children. And I was determined to protect my son from that at all costs. Ashanti is referring to the kidnapping of her sister Kanasha Douglas in 2002. Kanasha, who was just 16 years old at the time, was abducted off the street and held for ransom. Thankfully, she was safely returned to her family after a traumatic ordeal. That experience scarred me deeply, Ashanti admits. I saw how the media frenzy surrounding the kidnapping re-traumatized my sister and our family. I knew I could never put my own child through something like that. The singer also cites the intense public scrutiny faced by other celebrity parents as a major factor in her decision. Look at how the paparazzi harass and exploit famous kids, it's just so wrong, I refuse to let that happen to my son. Ashanti goes on to explain that her primary concern has always been her son's safety and well-being. I get it, the fans are curious and they want to see photos and know more. But at the end of the day, he's a child, he didn't ask for this life in the spotlight. As his mother, my job is to protect him, not exploit him for public consumption. The singer says she's also worried about the long-term psychological impact that public scrutiny could have on her son. I've seen how child stars struggle with issues like anxiety, depression, and substance abuse as they get older. I don't want that for my son. I want him to have as normal and healthy a childhood as possible. Ashanti admits that keeping her son out of the public eye hasn't always been easy. There have been so many times where I've wanted to share photos or talk about him. But I have to remember that his well-being has to come first. No amount of public attention is worth compromising that. Looking ahead, Ashanti says she plans to continue shielding her son from the spotlight for as long as possible. He's still so young, and I want to give him the chance to grow up without the constant glare of the cameras. Maybe when he's older and can make that decision for himself, then I'll consider sharing more. But for now, his privacy is non-negotiable. The singer also reveals that she's taken extensive security measures to protect her son's identity. I'm very careful about who has access to information about him. Only a small circle of trusted friends and family know anything, and I'm extremely cautious about social media and technology. Ashanti acknowledges that her decision may upset some fans, but she remains steadfast in her conviction. I know people are curious and they want to see him. But at the end of the day, he's my child, not a piece of public property. I have to do what I feel is best, even if it's not the most popular choice. As Ashanti concludes the interview, it's clear that her son's well-being will always be her top priority, no matter the cost. The singer has faced criticism and speculation over the years, but she remains unshakably committed to protecting her child's privacy and safety. I just want him to have a normal, happy childhood, Ashanti says. That's all that matters to me. Hopefully one day, when he's ready, he'll be able to share himself with the world.
but until then, he's mine. 